So I'm sure we all know and love AI. Like with ChatGPT, you can make uh, stuff, and there's a ton of different softwares out there for making art. But only recently has there been AI software out there that can make 3D models. Now just how far can you push this software? I've been able to make things like, you know, dragons and swords, and just cool looking 3D models. But what if you were going to try to make an entire city, or an actual person? Or things that aren't even objects, like a cloud of smoke, or, or a rainstorm? Or even the entire Fortnite map? If you want to check out the software, I'll leave a link in the description. It's called 3D AI Studio. Now, let's see what this thing is capable of. Okay, let's not waste any time messing around with basic 3D models. Let's just jump straight into the hardcore stuff. A city skyline, something sort of almost abstract in 2D. I want to see what it comes up with. Dang, okay. I mean, it's untextured, but that looks pretty cool. Yeah, especially from like really far away. I mean, it looks like a full on city, kind of like that one uh, Ian Hubert tutorial. I'm actually really impressed with that. I thought it was gonna like get all screwed up because a city skyline is kind of like more of a 2D thing, but no, it delivered. This is pretty good. All right, enough fooling around. Oh my God, dang, man. But what is- okay, I don't know what's happening at the bottom. That looks like a mistake, but yeah, I mean, the stuff up top is not that bad. Yeah, once again, I think this is pushing the software a little bit too far because you can see it can't even put textures on this stuff. There's just too many faces happening. And uh, I mean, it'd be great for a background prop once again, but like, yeah, this is uh, it's really pushing it. But I'm gonna push it further. Oh god, this might kill my PC. Okay, what did it make for this? I'm so curious. Uh, oh, what? Wait, that's actually really cool. It's so different. Like, like I don't have a map on me right now, but I'm pretty sure that's like basically the shape of Belgium, like as a country on a map. And like this, these are the, the Belgium flag colors as well. Like the yellow, the red, and then like the blackish red on top. So they like it like combined the flag with the country itself. That's that's crazy, man. That's actually really cool. That was crazy. But it did not break yet. I have to keep pushing it. Godzilla holding up a skyscraper while inside of the Grand Canyon. Perfect. Oh my god, it's photorealistic. <laughs> I mean I, I mean, uh, <laughs> like, it got Godzilla pretty accurate, and then, <laughs> I don't know what the skyscraper is doing, just floating next to him, and then the Grand Canyon is just straight up not here. Now it's time to move on to image to 3D. This means we can submit a picture, and then it'll just make a 3D model based off of that picture. Of course, we're going to start with the Fortnite map. Oh, that's freaky looking. Like all the POIs are technically 3D. If I go down to this, like a view like this, but then for like from the side, they still look all flat. It's weird. It's like, it's not quite the Fortnite map, but it still is at the same time. Honestly, not even that bad. I'm not disappointed with this, but now I want to do something really crazy. What if we picked straight up artwork? Okay, I think I broke it. It's, it's, it's starting to fall apart. But hey, we just gotta keep pushing it further and further. So I wanna revisit the text to 3D model for a second. Because if you haven't noticed, up until now, I've done, I've only done objects that can be like made in 3D. But what if we gave it like an abstract idea? <laughs> I don't know where that came from. I genuinely don't know what to think of this. What, what did it make? It's literally just Gollum, but with like broken textures. Okay, I'm gonna do one last prompt. Just all out the most random crazy thing I can possibly think of. And we're gonna see what this guy can make. Okay, I mentally threw up on the prompt and let's see what it makes. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> I can't even process what this thing put together. I it, it's like the more you look at it, the more things you notice. I I'm done with this uh with this software. Y'all have a good day. Um. I, 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 <coughs>